morning wrestling fans. Today is Saturday, April 1st, 2023. Happy WrestleMania Saturday, everyone. It's here, day one of WrestleMania 39 tonight, live from Los Angeles, California, SoFi Stadium. And things have already got off to a huge start this pro wrestling week last night with Ring of Honor, Super Card of Honor, and the WWE 2023 Hall of Fame ceremony. And just a real quick update. Uh, The injury to Dante Martin looks like he could have suffered a broken ankle, unfortunately. Don't know that for sure just yet, but that's what it looks like it could have been after that scary bump in the reach for the sky ladder match last night. And definitely want to send them get well wishes for a speedy recovery. And tonight, once again, is night one of WrestleMania 39. And, but first, this afternoon at 1 p.m. Eastern, we have NXT Stand and Deliver available on Peacock and the WWE Network everywhere else. On this episode of GMWF, I'm going to go over night one of WrestleMania Saturday tonight. There's the usual dog when I walk by. I'm sure he's excited for WrestleMania tonight. And I wonder about his prediction for the first match of the night that we already know is going to be for the WWE United States Championship. John Cena taking on Austin Theory. I I don't know how they're going to have this happen, but I think that it should be Austin Theory going over in this one and retaining over John Cena. John Cena definitely does not need the United States Championship. I'm sure they'll have a good match, but it should definitely be Austin Theory going over to retain. I, like I said, I'm not sure if they're have if they're gonna have them go over Cena clean and or if they will have them find some way somehow to cheat and get the victory. But I definitely think that they should have theory defeat Cena tonight. And the men's WrestleMania showcase match. Braun Strowman and Ricochet taking on the Street Profits, the Alpha Academy, and the Viking Raiders. This one, I could actually kind of see them having the Alpha Academy go over in this one with everything with Otis and Chad Gable. I could actually kind of see them getting the win. Or if not Alpha Academy, possibly I could see them having Strowman and Ricochet letting the baby faces get the win in this one. Seth 
freaking Rollins and Logan Paul tonight. Hopefully, it'll be Seth Rollins going over. There's been some talk about Logan Paul, his contract being up soon, and not sure if he'll be sticking around or not. And I'm definitely not the biggest Logan Paul fan. I didn't even know who he was before he got involved with WWE. But he he did surprise me at Crown Jewel last year with Roman Reigns and actually had a very good match with him. So I think Seth Rollins is a good guy to put in there with him that could get another good match out of him tonight. And the women's six-woman tag team match, we have Damage Control, Bailey, Dakota Kai, and EO Sky taking the team taking on the team of the man Becky Lynch and WWE Hall of Famers Lita and Trish Stratus. I think this one, I think might be kept kind of short, but might be an okay match, I'm sure. I think damage control is going to go over in this one. Uh, I know there's been some talk online about maybe Trish turning heel and so that is one way you could have them defeat uh, Lita Becky Lynch and Trish Stratus now I'm not sure if Trish does turn heel I don't know if that's going to lead to a feud or anything but I think it's going to be damage control getting the win in this one and the match that has been teased for quite a while and then was finally made official. Dominic Mysterio taking on his father, the new WWE Hall of Famer, Rey Mysterio. And not much happened last night at the Hall of Fame. Just uh, when Ray came out, Dominic just kind of ignored him, looked away, and then he ended up getting up and walking away during the speech. Uh, at one time, I thought that it could have been possible that maybe we could see Dominic defeat his father tonight, but especially when I was thinking of the stipulation of uh, Masker's hair. That's not happening, of course, but... And... It was, they announced it so late. I thought they would announce it sooner, had more of a build, that maybe it could be Dominic getting the win, but I think they're going to have Ray beat him tonight. And I wouldn't be surprised at all if we do have another match. And then maybe by SummerSlam, you can have a rematch. And maybe that's when you put the stip of Masker's hair on it. But who knows? But I think it's going to be Rey Mysterio getting a win over his son. And the two matches tonight that have been being talked about uh, possibly main eventing night one first for the Smackdown Women's Championship Charlotte Flair taking on Rhea Ripley I'm not sure I'm guessing Rhea's going to be out by herself I don't know if Dom's going to be with her or not I definitely think they should put the title on Rhea Ripley tonight Nothing against Charlotte Flair, but I think Rhea deserves the title right now and have a good run with it. So my pick for that one, 
Rhea Ripley defeating Charlotte Flair for the SmackDown Women's title. And this is the match, just my opinion, that I think should main event tonight. The Usos taking on Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn for the undisputed WWE Tag Team Championships. I'm sure they'll have a really good match. I, it's been maybe since, actually I think it's been since the first WrestleMania where a tag team match has main evented. And I think these four could pull out a great match for the first night. And that is WrestleMania Saturday tonight. Definitely looking forward to it. Like I mentioned last night on Wrestling Fanatic, I plan on having a new episode right after. Unless, uh, or I should say, maybe if there's a press conference first. I don't know if they're doing one on the first night, but uh, if there is one, I might watch the press conference first and then do the podcast. Don't know what time that's going to be, though, but since it is the two nights again, Hope we shouldn't be too late. So that's this WrestleMania Saturday episode of Good Morning Wrestling Fans. Thank you for tuning in, everyone, right here on Spreaker or wherever you listen to 360 Wrestling Podcast. Hope everyone has a great WrestleMania Saturday. Hope everyone enjoys all the shows you're watching today. And WrestleMania Night 1 tonight will be back later tonight and then tomorrow morning for the Wrestlemania Sunday episode of Good Morning Wrestling Fans. So, until then, keep watching pro wrestling and happy Wrestlemania Saturday.